Hello everybody and welcome to part 15 of my uh, Nuzlocke Diamond walkthrough. In the last part, we um, fought off the Eterna City Gym battle jigger thingy. And in this part, to begin, I just want to let you guys know that I did go to the Pokemart off camera and I bought about 10 escape ropes. I didn't get any of the honeys or the repels, which I forgot. I'm going to go grab right after this talking. Um, got a little bit of um, some other uh, thingamajiggers, but the most important thing is... Um, is uh, I got a bunch of Pokeballs, and I bought 10 from the Pokemart, which doing so allows you to get the Premier Ball, which is a pretty neat little thing. Um, for right now from the Pokemart, real quickly, I'm just going to grab some Repels. And buy 10 Repels. Now, the reason I'm going to put Repels is because I only want things that are of my level. After a little bit, of course. Just to the point where, like, it gets annoying for me to do things, to get anything done. Oh. Um, <laughs> my voice cracked there. Uh, I believe in the last part, I did give some, one of my, yeah, I gave Flamer a Grass Knot. Um, and you might wonder why I did that. That's just because I wanted a, a move on him, like a Grass-type move on him. And so I decided to do it. If you have a problem, sue me. But, um, alright, uh... Yeah, as you can tell, it's night time. It's about evening time as I'm recording this. This is the last day on a little break that I had going for me. Um, so, if you recall, if you might remember from the last part, we met uh, this trainer up here. I forget her name. I think it was Cynthia or something. And she gave us... Um, number one, she gave us the HM. She told us to check out this statue right here. There's some writing on the Pokemon statue. Creation of Dia, giver of time. And laughter, there's tears. And likewise, the same time flows, the blessing of Dia. The text is very legible and faded completely in places. They say this a Pokemon lived long, long ago. So, um... I don't know if we're allowed to head off into this new route. Okay, we are. So, to begin today's part, I'm going to do something really smart, actually, if you do say so myself. And that will be... To... Alright, All right, um, just want to start off, with, I guess, with the trainer battle. So, um, during this trainer battle, I guess I'll introduce what we're going to do in this part. Um, I actually, ooh, I'm going to have to adjust this, uh, this, this recording size. I think I caught a little bit of my desktop screen. That's embarrassing. Alright. Might have to do something with that. I'll, I'll figure something out. Maybe just black that out or something. Alright, anyways, at any rate, let's go for the grass knot. Um, I'm gonna show off why we're using Grass Knot right now for this exact reason. Now when we find kind of Geodudes and stuff, Flamer can utterly rape them. Of course he doesn't get the stab for it, but he still gets a lot, a lot of um, experience off of doing stuff like this. And Flamer can be our main guy right now. After all, he is our least level Pokemon. So I'm just showing this off just to show how cool you can sweep with my, with my Flamer now. That's why I always give my Glass Knot to Flamer. Um, yeah. Just some grass type move, you know what I mean? Of course you know what I mean. So anyways, I'm going to go back to my previous system, which is going to be to speed up uh, Trainer and um, other battles with a certain song. I picked the song, of course, depending on whatever is going through my head at the time. Now, we're going to begin with trying to catch a Pokemon. And then after that, we'll go after the main um, focus of this part. So we're going to catch a Geodude! Which, I don't know how I feel about. Eh, whatever. Uh, Pokemon's a Pokemon. Uh, fight will definitely crush it. Flame Wheel is the only th move on here that we can do that won't utterly destroy it. It'll do minimum damage. Minimum damage. Good. We'll just allow him to keep doing this. Of course, Geodude, you'd probably imagine that Geodude's not going to learn that cool of moves quite yet. Um, it's going to be quite a pain for us to deal with the Geodude on our team, indeed. Uh, at any rate, I think it's useful. Geodude. I've always followed Geodude to be more useful than Onix or any other Pokemon. Uh, of course, you have to train him in order to get a Graveler. Uh, trade him, rather. But, um, you know, I'm going to do my research. Maybe let's figure out there's a way for me to get around that. And if not, um, a Graveler's just fine the way he is. I'm going to go for a Pokeball. Um, Premier Ball wise, I think I have a Pokemon that I'm definitely going to try to use for the Premier Ball. That is, of course, considering we're allowed to. So, I 
Let's see, I have several names for this guy. Uh, I have Rocky. Alright, I'm just gonna go uppercase because I did with the other Pokemon. I got Rocky. You know, because Rocky is in Rock, Rocky Balboa. Or Hardball. I think Rocky's gonna be our our, um, our standard nickname for it. Yeah, I can't think of any cool nicknames quite yet. So I got my Pokemon. Let me first now just approach where we have to go. I'm gonna go to the Pokemon Center real quickly. I'm gonna trade around these Pokemon a little bit. And then so begins my task of training Geodude up. So yeah, I'm gonna wrestle my Pokemon. I think we have six. We only have five, so we only have four good usable Pokemon. Alright, not bad. And they hope to see us again. Indeed, they do. Let's uh, figure this out. I mean, we uh, move around my thing, people around. Switch uh, Rocky with Flamer. Move, okay, and that should be good. Justin, of course, never going to be used ever. So, except for right now, <laughs> Justin's going to be used right now as we break up, as we cut down. Our thingy majigger. Cool story. Now, nothing else we can really do here. Um, actually, I'm curious right now for one thing. I'll be right back in five seconds. I guess we'll never catch that Pokeball. Whatever. <laughs> um, but Geodude, uh, Geodude, Justin did open the thing up, so let's storm the castle. Alright, so, yeah. Um, let's make this interesting. Let's talk to him. Team Galactic is an interesting in the world. Our gaze is beyond the stars. Ooh. And then suddenly we catch into our um, our main battle. So we have a double battle going on right now. That's just too great, right, guys? It's just way too great. Uh, so we have a Geodude. And I think uh, Zomji Squirrel's up next. So Wormpole and Zubat. I can definitely keep out my, um, my, my Zomji Squirrel for this. And maybe even keep out Rocky. Uh, let's see here. Okay, so now we're finished with that. Let's go up to this main attraction. Let's talk to these guys, see what's going on. What do you got to say? Oh man, these are optional trainers that I got to fight off camera. Well, that's what I'll do, I guess. I'll just fight off camera. I won't even show this battles because they're so insignificant on the grand scheme of things. So there's to all those who think that Rocky was a stupid decision because he's absolutely killing it right now. And yeah, like I said, I'm going to fight all these guys off camera. I'm trying to find something that I needed. What was it? Yeah, I needed, I'm just going to put a random potion, just a standard potion on Rocky. I don't feel too confident with his ability to stay alive. Um, yeah, this is pretty boring. Okay. Yeah. Okay, they love it when people come across and donate their Pokemon. Unfortunately, it's going to be you who's going to be donating your Pokemon. Besides, you look ugly. Alright, so, um, oh man, I can't even get two words in. You kidding me? Whatever, man. I'll just, I'll just kill you and then talk to my views. Mm, yeah. Alright, anyways, um, so, I don't know why I'm saying anyways, anyways, um, uh, so, so, uh, I don't, uh, yeah. okay, I'm gonna switch out my Pokemon, actually, no, I'll, I think I could, I don't really, um, no, I don't know if I should start off with my Rocky or my Zomji Squirrel, um, actually, I can leave my Rocky up, worst case scenario, I could just switch into Flamer, which is what I'm probably gonna wind up doing, so let's talk to this guy, 
Why did it take a Pokemon? Why are they trying to accomplish? No. Now let's talk to him. Eh, did you want something? How silly of me to even ask. You want me to free the Pokemon? Yeah, that's gonna happen. Team Galactic! It's time for us to take them down once more. Zubat. He's got a Zubat? Well, I got myself Rocky. Rocky Balboa. Giga Drain. Okay, that's gonna do some damage. That's how I'm not gonna lie, that's gonna do some damage. Or no! Damn it! I was so close to having a rock type too. No, Rocky! Come on, you can't just survive one move. No, Rocky. Now I just gotta put on my flame. I don't even know if my flamer is gonna. No, Rocky. Oh shit, no. And, and flying. No, no, fighting is. Uh, fly, fighting is weak to that. Why did I do that? No. Giga Drain again. Better not kill him off. Better not kill him off. Come on, come on, Flamer. There we go, Flamer. Ah, damn it, man. Oh. Rocky died the first move. No, come on, dude. I needed you. You can't do this to me. Man. Only the Pokemon I have that's going to be any good is... Only other Pokemon I have is gonna be any good is OMG Squirrel. Against Zubat. Now Zubat's dead, so that's not even a problem anymore, I guess. Skuntank. This is a new Pokemon I've never heard of, actually. Let's see, Skuntank's gonna be a what? What's Skuntank gonna be? It's gonna be a poison dart. Let's see, so that means that he's, uh. He's weak to ground, uh, that means he'd be, which sucks because, guess who just died? But he's damaged normally by fire and all that good chaz, 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 yes indeed chaz. I'm gonna switch into, um, let's see here, what should I do? I'm gonna use one of my, um, super potions right now, I'm not taking any chances with Flamer, who's one of the most my most important Pokemon dying right now. I'm not gonna have that happen. If Flamer's gonna die, it's gonna be for something else, not because of this stupid guy. Poison gas. I might do something. And then I had my Peach Berry, which I completely forgot that I had, so cool chiz for me. I'm gonna use Mock Punch, get the STAB and the first time first chance to move gonna do some damage but not much and damn it poison gas is gonna poison me again it's the last thing I want though I don't know if it doesn't know any other moves though maybe it's trying maybe it has a combo I don't know how these I don't know how these um these guys work I don't know Let's see here Ooh, screech that's, that's a problem I'm gonna uh, let's see so his special defense is a little bit less so Gonna go with Flame Wheel. Hope. Oh, Night Slash. That's gonna kill him. That's gonna kill him off, isn't it? Oh shit. Oh shit. No! 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 Oh man, Flamer! Oh, I wasted Grass Knot on you, Flamer! Oh man, I don't even know what's. Oh shit, <laughs> Flamer and I can't believe it, Flamer and Rocky both just died, and we're not even through his Pokemon set yet. Oh. Well, I guess welcome to Nuzlocke World. It's about time. Now, if I had Aerial Ace in this guy, he wouldn't die ever. Man, but Flamer. 
Man, Flame was my first Pokemon, dude. God, now all I have left is like Birdie and Zombie Squirrel. Both of my Pokemon just died. Like, how does that even happen? And at what cost did I... Oh, oh man. Alright, whatever. <laughs> Flamer's gonna go down. Fuck that, man. <laughs> so I don't even play Pokemon anymore. Whatever. It's a Nuzlocke Diamond when these things happen. Now... Uh, we beat off Team Galactic, so that's a good, that's a plus. And so he's gonna thank us, and he's gonna ask us to stop by his cycle shop, which is what I'm gonna do. But first, we gotta go to the death box. Alright. And I just installed the friendship checker. Alright. Not in this Nuzlocke Diamond run, because now we have three more, two more Pokemon to add to our death box. See, my death box is what? Death box is box number four. Let's rename it, actually. Just click death box. Perfect number of letters. God, <laughs> that took a little bit more time. So inside here. Let's deposit our two Pokemon right now. As well as Monferno. No, no chance, no point in continuing our box operations anymore. Let's heal up my Pokemon. And let's see what happens next, guys. This is going to be a very interesting run now that I lost one of my major contingents to my party, my fire type Pokemon. I'm going to have to catch someone else now, aren't I? Too bad for me, I waited like an idiot and I caught a Geodude too early. Now I'm going to check out my map to see what's going to happen next. And after checking out my map, we'll call it a part. So let's see here, inside my map, the map, map, very, very cool map. No, I just saw the mod, I skipped the map, what am I doing? Let's check this out, so, we could head to Mount Coronet. But instead of that, we're going to take this time to travel the down cycling road to a better city. Actually, I don't really quite understand what we're going to do next. I'm going to have to try to see if I can remember it off camera. But as you can see, it's about nighttime, so I think it's time that I say sayonara. So, yeah. One last thing before I go. I'm going to show off the cycling bike. Cycling, uh, we're going to get a bike, actually, obviously. I'm going to get that bike real quick. Heading here into the cycling shop and head up here and talk to him. Hey man, can I have a bike? Well, thanks man, I got a bicycle. Yeah, man, 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 thanks. Yeah. Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. Shut up, shut up, shut up. Shut up. I'm gonna register that actually to my, um, my thingy. You can't ride it indoors, obviously. And then Roman's gonna come in and be like a little stun butt, so let's go. This is... This is for absolutely fastest. You know, technically this pot, this place doesn't count. Right here is where route the route 211 begins. So technically, I could catch a Pokemon here. Um, that's up to that's up to debate, actually. So, but at any rate, it's high time that we finish today's part. 
Um, so yeah, a lot happened, guys. You know, part 15. I expected something like this to happen in 13, not 15, but... Check out our party one last time before we begin. It's only down to these two, these two fellows, these two pals, OMG Squirrel and Birdie. So I'm going to take it upon myself the next time to catch a Pokemon from here, show you guys what I catch. Maybe even show it on camera or off camera, maybe begin that. But at any rate, um, next time we're going to continue on, and that's a promise. But until then, it's time to say sayonara, so guys, see you guys later. Yeah.